So today we're going to the Philippines, and I'm not alone. Hello. <laughs> Twenty hours in an airplane. No. We made it. Hello, good morning. So it's the May holiday. We came to the Philippines for a little break. I guess I guess our Philippines day will be about checking out resorts. This is the Crimson one. So we're at the ticketing booth, booth now, trying to get a ticket to, to the ferry. Fun times. Fun times. That's like two hours to go. How does that feel to go to a hall with no luggage? Don't care, I have spare on these in my purse. So where are we now? Bohol! Bohol, after a long two-hour boat ride, it was really difficult. We were in the difficult class. Yes, the difficult class, meaning it was cheap, but it was not comfortable. Most importantly, we have to sit with common people. <laughs> I can't put that on mine. <laughs> I need to chop those parts Hashtag off. Hashtag joke. <laughs> <laughs> you, would, you would definitely need a vlog. So the resort is called South Palms. We need we need a rest. Let's check out our little hut. All right, let's get ready for the pools. Bums out, thumbs up. Perk them up, perk them up. Shake your booty. There you go. The Philippines. Weather is amazing. The resort pretty awesome as well. We have a couple of days planned. We are at Bohol. We will try to cruise around and try to understand a little bit more about this island. Philippines has a lot of islands. I'm not gonna, I'm not even gonna try to pretend we, we're gonna visit parts of the Philippines. If you want to learn more about the Philippines, there's this dude, uh, Lost Leblanc. He, he made a whole series about the islands and about, about the Philippines. So Lost Leblanc is the guy you need to check out. He goes into the Philippines in depth. As usual, I'm just you know, enjoying a couple of days of relaxation before going back to the hustle. The islands are so isolated. It's also a great spot to to stargaze and to take some star photos. Uh, yesterday night, there was a, there were some clouds in the sky, but I still managed to take a couple of pictures. So we're basically trying to enjoy this little peaceful moment for a couple of days. The resort is, as you can see, I'll, I'll drop some footage here, pretty, pretty peaceful. Not as crowded as I was expecting it to be, since it's a holiday, it's a May 1st holiday. It is tricky to get here. Uh, the flights to Cebu arrive late in the evening and you need to catch a ferry to get to Bohol. That forced us to, to stay one night in Cebu. There's a sign in the entrance of this, of this resort that says you're entering a peaceful place. Please leave your worries behind. So 
So it's time to drop some B-roll slow-mo. I think I have enough footage. I'm starting to get hungry. I wanna hit the gym. I wanna watch Game of Thrones. It's time to wake up the wife. Good morning. Okay, so the plan today is very simple. We're gonna hit the gym, maybe. We're gonna do some kayaking. Let's try to snorkel a little bit because we brought the snorkeling equipment. Most of all, let's enjoy this summer weather. We're gonna see the smallest primate on Earth. Tarsier. We are at the Tarsier Sanctuary. Where these beautiful little creatures are being taken care of. They are the smallest primates on Earth. They are nocturnal animals. And their eyes don't turn, so the whole head turns around like owls. They're really tiny. After the Tarsiers and after the Chocolate Mountains or Chocolate Hills, we came to the man-made forest. It's uh, on the road to wherever we're going now. It's all insert the caption later. It's trafficy. There are cars everywhere, and there are some necessary pictures you need to take when you're here, like this one. It's nice, but it's it's a must-do. It's you need to see it. It's green, luscious. It's full of trash, though. Uh, this is something that I don't accept. It's sad because it's a it's a really pretty road. I think we have a few of these in Portugal, though. So we came to the hanging bridge, which seems pretty legit when you see it from the outside. The ticket is like thirty-five pesos. This is the hanging bridge. It's full of people. I hope it, it's designed to last this wait. So we made it to the other side. So that's just 50% of the problem, right? Now we have the other 50% right there. So this is apparently the first church in Asia, Baklayan Immaculada Concepcion Church. Fortunately, it is closed. They close for lunch, which is strange for a church. I come from Portugal, so I know how churches are supposed to operate. Anyway, back to the hotel, let's get some beach time. Ooh, this is hot, so this is the blood pack. Well...
Look at those beautiful sunrise colors. <sighs> so, holidays are over. Today is the last day. We're leaving in 15 minutes. We need to catch a ferry, go to the airport. It's, it's gonna be a long ride. And we're gonna go back to Shanghai. We didn't see enough, right? There, there are a lot of islands in the Philippines. We, we visited one of them. Um, basically, it was a beach holiday, so we didn't do much more than that. It was also a great place for stargazing. I managed to take a few few star pictures. Right, off to the ferry. So ferry to Cebu coming up and blessed. The flight is delayed, we need to have a pit stop in Hong Kong. They're all ready. Alright guys, I think this is it. Uh, we just got back to Shanghai. No waiting in the immigration, no waiting in the taxi line. This was perfect. Perfect arrival, let's go home to see our cats. Lessons learned. One. I need to practice with the equipment. I noticed that every time I have to do a long exposure or film with 120p so I can slow-mo it afterwards, I need to go online and try to figure out how to do it with the camera. I'm still learning. Lesson number two, I need to trim down the amount of equipment I've ca I'm carrying with me. I'm, I'm just carrying too much equipment. I had far more equipment than I had clothing. It's a hobby, it's, I'm not a pro, so I shouldn't be carrying so much equipment. It's the tripod, the batteries, the chargers, the drones, the cameras, the GoPro stuff. That I, I cannot break my back because of my hobby. But, you know, always learning. Don't forget to subscribe. I'll see you in my next video. Look at it. What about you? All good.